toothpick, who we now call Rascal, was found in the mud and was covered with fleas and he weighed less than eight ounces. He spent a lot of time by himself just while they were bringing him back to an health. And he'd spent some time in foster care, just kind of getting socialized again so that he could be around other cats. You and me. Yay. We went down to ARF, and in the process of walking around, one little black cat, Galaxy, Galaxy. reached up to the glass to Susan on floor level in the cage was Toothpick. And he saw me come in and his paws shot right out of the cage. And so I went over and that was it. I just had to have that. We came home with these two special kittens and they have been magic. They romp around, they eat, they sleep, and they play and then they eat again. <laughs> The whole experience of ARF taking on these challenging animals that come from very distressed situations and going through all the effort and the medical cost. And the fact that ARF can take a half alive little animal and turn it into Nurturing. what is make, bringing us more laughter than we've had in the last eight years. It's just amazing. I mean, we wake up laughing and we go to bed laughing at these cats. I just came away feeling like we are so lucky to have an organization like this here. It's the best place to go if you want an animal in your life. When making a donation, every bit that anybody can send in, it just builds up. Every and, donation uh, Every matters. donation is valuable. ARF makes a point of being in and part of the community. So we're all kind of mindful of this incredible facility that yeah. we should all support. I've never felt better about writing a check than I did when I contributed to ARF. The benefit of what they're doing just make you realize that this has got to keep going. When you are in the presence of an animal that's just happy to be alive and to be sharing your home with you, for me, it diminishes a lot of my complaining <laughs> about my life. And it makes me see a much bigger picture. It would be a loss not to have that experience in life.